Fredrickson Realty, how may I direct your call? Fredrickson Realty, how may I direct your call? Fredrickson Realty, how may I direct your call? Ten years! Ten years ago I was selling stereos out of trunk of my car. Don't try to tell me about the business. I know. Can't you just imagine sitting there having a cup of decaf? He told you what? But you love the location. Freeways, we got freeways all over the city. Okay then, we have an understanding. Philip, no, that's his companion. Look, I'd really love to close this deal, but I've got another guy that's supposed to be calling me today. He's the artistic one. Did all that fabulous sponge painting in the bathroom. No, that's more than a commitment. Can I put you on hold real quick? In fact, I think he's doing some stuff for Demi Moore. He's just bitter. Personally, I don't want to go negative. You're not going to believe this, but that's him on the other line. Sure thing? You want a sure thing? You should have joined the Coast Guard. No, ma'am. It's definitely earthquake damage. Now, don't you worry. We're going to find you a place. Time is our friend. Hi, I'm Buddy Brewer, one of the boys in the neighborhood. As you can see, we are selling real estate. Let me give you the tour. Steve Whisk, slimy, reptilian. He tells you it's sunny outside, bring an umbrella. He wants closed to sale with his one free phone call from jail. Jeremy, where have we seen this Eagle Scout before? You happy with those groceries, ma'am? I'll have her in by 10, sir. This guy goes over three. It's on a tower with a high powered rifle. This is Jill. Cell phone, day runner, Franklin planner. Jill, you should make a list. So, that's the hell that is my life. Manipulation, false modesty, disingenuous banter. But the numbers don't lie. It works. You tell me that honesty is the best policy, don't you believe it? Nice guys, strictly second division. Washington Senators. Boys and girls, just got off the phone with New York. Let me tell you something. My back's against the wall, my ass is in a sling, and my nose is bleeding. So this is what I'm gonna do. We gotta get busy. We gotta sell some dirt. So I'm gonna make it interesting. This is coming out of my end. My kids trust fund. The white tree model and the lake house at Arrowhead. I'm bleeding, you guys got the tourniquet. So here's the deal. We can mount it. First class airfare. Condo with wet bar and rental car. Mid-sized but spacious. How about a 2% bump on the commission? What am I, your blood bank? All right, 2%. I got this in the bag. I'm close on three different deals. I wonder if Buddy remembers that we agreed to split that commission. I know there's something I'm forgetting. I should make a list. Hmm. Hope the Thai kitchen still has that spicy chicken on the buffet. Hey, Buddy, you closed any deals? No, oh, actually, I lost two today. One had earthquake damage. Earthquake? You never say earthquake. This is L.A. Everything has earthquake damage. It's not considered earthquake damage if they think it was built that way. I say I'm a nice guy. Yeah, nice guys finish last. Hell, nice guys don't finish at all. Creative visualization. The method of obtaining goals through meditation. If one sees himself obtaining his goals during meditation, then they will come to pass. This is the magic of creative visualization. Some see a man eating his lunch alone in the park. I think not. May I? Sure. 
Half a sandwich? Amen. On the journey of discovery. Verbal repetition? Oh, effective. I'm not saying the author had bad intentions. Personal power, oh my gosh. Bring your checkbook, big jaw. <laughs> Creative visualization? I can tell that we are both seekers. Oh, that, yeah, I'm just uh, looking for a little edge. You know, personally, professionally. Magic? Yeah, something, anything. A concept very sacred to my people. Yeah, I just started this. Just about a third of the way through. You have any thoughts? I will give you better than thoughts. Your search is at an end. Practice your creative visualization, close your eyes, and chant these words out loud. Anything you see yourself doing will come to pass. It is just that simple. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Who is that guy? That's the Murtamira Raju. What's his deal? You just have to experience him. Does, does he have a website? Open-minded? I'm open-minded. What about that Fang Shuang ritual? Fang Shui. You're talking about a civilization that's been around a million years. It's, it's a proven science. Oh, really? They were hanging out with the dinosaurs? Betty, please don't scoff. These are timeless truths repackaged for a new generation. What about that $400 paperweight sitting on your coffee table? Yeah, crystals. All right, you got me there. Guilty as charged. But I don't think I did it right. Hey, but even you have to admit, it's pretty curious that one green crystal rebuilt Superman's fortress and restored his power. Huh? Don't tell me they didn't research that. That was a movie. Are oh, you dwelling on the negative? Besides, I wanted something new. Met this guy today. He's Stop. Why is the phrase I met this guy always followed by your credit card number? Two words. Creative visualization. Get this. This guy knew all about it. This isn't from some infomercial. Mind you, it's not for everyone. They gave me full access to the magic and charged me nothing, nothing in return. Something so powerful. Oh, this guy's real good. Buddy, you are a bright and wonderful guy. You don't need crystals, or the furniture on one side of the room, or walking through a doorway backwards. But if you don't believe in yourself, how can I? I care for you, and I love you, but this obsession with this so-called magic is just... Oscar, you talk well. What are you doing? I'm visualizing the evaporation of this traffic. Where's Brewer? He's uh, showing the Buckingham property. Ah, the Buckingham property. Who's he showing that to? Virgil Baxter Pennington. Huh. Well, aren't you guys the salt of the earth? Cream of the crop, real square G's. Who is this Pennington? I don't have him on any of my lists. He claims to be the heir to the G. Heidelman brewing fortune, but uh, we suspect that he spent a great deal of time on an estate in Camarillo. Camarillo? Near the state mental facility? Bingo.
I'm concerned about these trees. They're live oaks, sir. They're 100 years old. We, there's a 10-man crew to look after them. Of course, they may be trimmed back. Tiny room land my Sikorsky. I'm sometimes called away to board when he's downtown. Yes, sir, I'll call the FAA and see if I can get a variance. Sure, oh, where was I? Tell me your name again. Uh, buddy, sir. Buddy? Yeah, buddy. Spend a moment talking about staff quarters. Absolutely. Like most people in my position, I travel with an entourage of 10 to 15 individuals, butler, chauffeur, caterers, the usual. Many of these individuals have been in our employ for quite some time. I want to make sure their quarters are comfortable. Of course, sir. Actually, sir, where, where is this, Dad? It's an excellent question. Where? Tell me your name again. Uh, Buddy, sir. Buddy Brewer. You have a humorous quality about you, Buddy. I like it. Oh, thank you, sir. Uh, as you know, this property, uh, this property is listed at 9.5. 9.5? Yes, sir, 9,500,000. Uh, oh, buddy, why, why, why? Why what, sir? Why did you have to sully our moment with talk of money? Mm. I need a second. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Talk of a husky, talk. Oh, buddy. Yes, sir. Do you have a pen? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. How was your date with the Sultan of Brunei? Did you get a commitment? I did better than that. It's an escrow. What? Thirty day escrow? No, thirty minute. I got a check. Buddy, that check isn't any good. What do you mean? Ten million dollars? The guy probably doesn't have ten dollars. We're talking about a guy who has to be back at the clinic by dusk. It was a mean joke, buddy. They were playing a mean joke. ourselves a winner. You guys really came through. Save my ass and wipe my nose. Just doing my job, boss. Yeah, well, that's great, Steve. But our winner bagged the big one, Virgil Baxter Pennington. Buddy Brewer, incredible job. But that sale was bogus. That guy's a mental case. I don't think so. Check cleared. I tell you, I had some really nice things to say about you, buddy. I think his exact words were, I never met a more patient, outstanding young man than Buddy Brewer. Congratulations. Knew you could do it. Here's your ticket. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> You forget something at the office, you late for an appointment, call ahead, huh? That's the magic of cell touch. Brazil? What? Perfect masters on the street pushing cell phones? What happened to the disciples, the, 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 the true believers? <laughs> that didn't work out. At least on the building expired. Too much overhead. I'm not gonna be started on that. What are the words? Oh yeah, how did those work out? How'd they work out? <laughs> they changed my life. Uh, they usually do. <laughs> Look, anyway, you just a sham? This, this whole thing's just a big con? Hey, did I take any money from you? No. No? You got your money's worth. You know, Rezu, you're right. This thing is pretty clear. Betty, Betty, it's me. Pack your bags. We're going to Maui. And you'll never guess who I ran into. 